what, what the mate is talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Warning. This video is going to run you hot. It shows how serious the police are about the safer at home order and how flippantly some members of the public is taking it. A huge squadron of cops descended on the Hyde Park area of Los Angeles on Saturday evening to break up a one-year-old's birthday party. The video shows at least 32 officers brandishing batons and even beanbag guns as they force furious partygoers to disperse. Police were responding to reports of 30 to 40 people gathered at a home in the 5500 block of 4th Avenue at a time when the city has been ordered to stay at home to prevent the spread of COVID-19. When several of the party goers became irate, they called for backup. And I'm talking about they were deep. Family, these people, showed their naked asses, cussing the police, threatening the police. When several other people became irate, officers called for backup and declared the gathering an unlawful assembly. As the video shows, the officers formed a line across the street and slowly marched, forcing the crowd back and eventually out into the intersection. They were backed up by several squad cars while a police chopper can be heard overhead. The mostly female group of party goers hurled insults and obscenities at the officers the entire time and refused to move. Some women clung to children as the police advanced. Even when things got physical, they refused to move. They had to be pushed out into the intersection. At one point, an officer is heard on a loudspeaker saying that they are going to use less lethal munitions, meaning that they were going to use bean bags on them. So you see the cops, you know, with the guns, with the bean bag guns, ready to shoot. These fools out there in the damn street, risking their lives, risking the lives of those little kids for a damn party during a pandemic. Oh, no, man, this ain't on the police here, man. This is all on them. And it's a damn shame that these were black women Showing their ass like this. These are the type of women that your mama warned you about. Good God. What the hell were they thinking? If they doing all of this for a one-year-old birthday party, just imagine. They say birds of a feather flock together. Ooh, man. That's a bunch of ignorance right there. All together in one flock. I mean, they're just egging each other on. And then the one, I'll show you the video, what, the one in the, the jacket, the blue jean jacket, oh, she the queen fool. The hell were they thinking? It ain't that serious. The one-year-old, oh man, that one-year-old probably, that one-year-old don't stand a damn chance, man. They shouldn't have been having a party in the first place. What the hell is wrong with people? I know everybody ain't got it all. I got that. But damn, if you got more than one person hanging out together, somebody need to have some damn sense. Somebody needs to be the voice of reason or everybody going to get killed. Damn. Man, we got to do better, family. This is ridiculous. The officers show an unbelievable amount of restraint. 
I got to give them credit. They did that. And this is Los Angeles. You know how Los Angeles get down. You know how LAPD get down. But they pushed them as far as they could go. And if they had rolled on any one of them, they would have been in the right. Because they're not only risking their lives, they're risking the lives of those children who went, the children don't know, no, they don't know no damn better. They, they're looking at the adults for guidance. So if the adults, some of the kids probably don't even know nothing about what's going on with this coronavirus thing. So they're just going by what their guardians tell them, what their mothers are saying, okay, we're going to the party, okay, we're going to the party. They don't know that they're risking their lives. So not only are they risking their lives, their children's lives, they're risking the lives of all of us. The cops would have been well within their rights to handle them. Oh, man. This made my head hurt. I ain't got no more, fam. I'm gone. No more talk. What the talking about? Yeah.